They love him. They, they, they've been yeah, talking about him. They've been talking about him. <laughs> so this is Jean Gillet. He's got his home. Yeah. So these folks have another cat at home. That cat's name is Emma. And I think Jean is going to fit in like crazy. He's mm -hmm. going to be just wonderful. Hey, they're over here. The webcam friends are here. Hey. This is about that big scary noise came from back there. He is just a very gorgeous boy, and he's just a hunk of goo. Yeah, he's. I was telling his new mom and dad that when he came in, um, he just acted like he'd always been here, as you guys know that, because you saw him from the very beginning. It was just like he'd always been here. This is the kitty that Angie and Jackie P and uh, Anthony found underneath the porch deck, and he was so cold. I don't know if you guys knew or not, but he had frostbit pads on his back feet. His front ones are pretty good. He's got one there. But he was one cold, wet cat when they brought him in the house. And it's obvious somebody loved him big time when, when, wherever, whoever had him. He's just a mush. He mm -hmm. is a handsome hunk of goo. <laughs> so... He'll be back, though. He's going to need another set of vaccines and nails trimmed again and ears rechecked and another warmer. So he'll be back early January. All right. Well, let me get his adoption bag, too. These are just two examples, Friskies, um, Freeman that we don't recommend. First ingredients is ground yellow corn, blues, rice, chicken byproduct. This is chicken byproduct, and there's no real protein. These are some that we do use. This is probably the number one. It's Purina One, but it's a huge difference from Purina to Purina One. And you can use this another one, Imes. But the first ingredient is chicken or turkey or fish. It's a whole, okay. a whole protein. Yeah, because um, we have to go, we have to, go <laughs> to uh, soft food for our roosters because we have uh, diabetes or yeah. that, that, that blood through the fog. Yeah, and so that's we've got a lot of it. Well, so, and he's food. used to, our vets say, I uh, yeah. highly recommend canned food. Yeah, um, yeah we do dry and, and water 24-7. And then canned food, like him, he'll easily eat 
or pee on this size a day by yourself. Yes. Okay. And that's fine. So that would be a half a day. And then uh, I'll send this one. Mm -hmm. But we would do half of this portion in the morning, half in the afternoon. Make sure you get a, got a nap. Don't let it drop. Mm -hmm. um, and then litter boxes. How many do you have? You have four. I saw that on your paper. <laughs> that is wonderful. Okay. That's cool. I love actually that. actually a whole half yeah. Okay, that's wonderful. <laughs> Stick that in there. That's the most important paperwork. If you could read through that today, and if you have questions, I would appreciate you following. That's this record, and um, just remember that date, Angie, where you six ish, yeah, and just give me a call. And. Adoption, and we have this special blanket given to us. To and I thought, well, we'll pass it out to somebody around Christmas time. So uh, kind of matches, <laughs> kind of looks good, doesn't it? So yeah, I like it. I like yeah. it. So this will be his as well. Yeah, we'll just stuff it in on top. Yeah. Okay. Yep. And then he loves these foil toys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's Mary, and they're just kind of everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> he likes these spring tilt foils. You can get these at Pet Supply Plus. And, uh, do you have any questions? No. Okay, thank you. Let me, oh, thank you. So when you get home, the best thing to do is put this on the floor and just leave them in there for 10, 15 minutes. And then kind of coax Emma to come over to, so she's aware there's another kitty. And then um, while he's still in here, those 10, 15 minutes, shut the extra bedroom doors, make the house a little bit smaller. And then once he's out, he's probably just going to cruise about and check things out. If Emma says, stay away from me a little bit, it's not going to hurt his feelings. Um, probably within 24, 48 hours, he'll be just fine. Okay. Big changes in your young life. Yeah, thank you. I think this is a wonderful one. Let me get a couple peacock feathers to you. <coughs> and when he comes out of the crate, maybe play with this with him, and that'll kind of distract him and him. Yeah. yeah. And then there you go. Okay. So we're here for questions, worries, problems. If you in a couple weeks how it's born, oh, yeah. okay. and then we'll be in touch then, or you'll be in touch with us the first of January. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Bye, Chandelier. Okay. And your crate's Thank all you. hooked up, bud. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. I always, I'm a worry, worry. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank you so much. Thank you.